What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So I'm gonna show you guys how to disable that really annoying shortcuts kind of banner pop-up that you get when you open up custom icons that you made from the shortcuts application. Now this is kind of in continuation to a previous video I did guys. Uh, it was for icon board and how to um, theme icons like a pro on iOS 14. I highly suggest you guys watch that video first and then come back to this one because this will make a little bit more sense. And it also shows you some crucial steps um, with disabling shortcuts, notifications and stuff like that. So I highly suggest you guys watch that video. Uh, but anyways, um, in that video, I covered how to do basically all the different applications. So icon board I use for the third party apps like Instagram or Spotify. And then for stock Apple applications, to avoid having redirects, I use the shortcuts application. But one annoyance that you get when you do that is you receive this pop-up. Now this works, I would say probably like 85% of the time. It doesn't guarantee it's gonna work every time, but it does for the most part. So if I go ahead and open up the phone application, I have it enabled for this. Um, and obviously this is a stock Apple application. So hopefully I don't get the banner pop-up and I did not as you guys seen there. So like I said, this does work most of the time, but it's not quite 100%, but it's pretty close. So as you can see, I'm not getting any kind of pop-ups for the phone application. So the way you're gonna do this is you go into the shortcuts application and you go ahead and click on the plus button, create personal automation, and then you're gonna swipe down until you see the app option there. And then you leave it checked is opened. So leave that checked choose your application. I'm going to go ahead and do settings. Just like so, go ahead and click on done. And then now we're going to do next. And now we have to add an action. And the action we want is just simply called number. So there it is right there. Just go ahead and select on number, leave the number as it is. It shows like 42 right there. Just leave it alone. Click on next. And now you make sure you uh, disable ask before running. So turn that off and then do not ask and then click on done. And now the settings application should no longer, at least for the most part, get a little pop-up when I launch it. So it did that time. I've noticed that if you kill it from multitasking, it sometimes will help with that. And as you can see, there you go. There is no pop-up. Let's go ahead and run it again. Again, no pop-up. And it seems to be working just fine. And I think one of the biggest tricks is to make sure you kill that app from multitasking so it takes the changes in effect with it. Now, big shout out to Boomhacks. I discovered this trick from him. I will leave his channel link down in the description. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. And if you guys wanna see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. Later.